Good late afternoon and welcome back to my garage. It is the 15th of October, time for the monthly video. We're going to talk about the 24 volt system, which is this one right here. We're going to talk a little bit about uh, what's been going on this month and how we achieved what we achieved. So first things first, let's hop in and take a look at the numbers here. It is 15 after 5, so it's pretty late in the day. Still getting 2.6 amps out of it, though. I can't complain. And the load here should come up 178. That's up from 171. That is all the outside lights. And if you want to know what those outside lights actually entail to get that 7 kilowatts that it used last month, tune in. I got a video I'm going to drop later on tonight that shows what the outside lights are doing. And here we are with this one. It is at 516 up from 479. That makes 37 kilowatts for the month, plus the seven for the outside lights on this one. That makes 44 kilowatts total for this system. That's not too bad at all for a 24 volt, 200 amp hour system. Now there are 400 watts for the panels up there on the roof. And I have moved into this part here so we can talk about, well, let me see if I got something around here. I guess I don't. Let's use this. All right, moved into this part so we can talk about what's been going on for the past week. Uh, I'm sorry, two weeks here. This is the first and we had a full battery, as you can see, and every up, every undulation is a day. And we had all three on, the sump pump, the big refrigerator upstairs, and the college size refrigerator in the basement, all the way up to this point. So that was probably a good seven or eight days. Uh, as you can see, it started getting down there a little bit. So I put the sump pump back on the grid, and we ran with both refrigerators here until I decided to charge, which is right here. And two days worth of charge, and we have a full battery again. Now that was the... 14th and if I don't know if this will let me do that or not we'll try to go into tomorrow come on why are you doing that all right so that's today and yesterday let's back up one day so as you can see we didn't have any load on it here uh and charged all the way up and as you can see we hit the limiter there so that means we got a full battery uh, and and Right before that happened, if you can tell, it started undulating a little bit. I put the big refrigerator back on this uh, system, and over the course of a day, we moved to tomorrow. It has come to the point here where it almost went off, but it didn't. It was 27.2 or so. Let's see what we got there. Yeah, 27.1. Yeah, there you go. 27.25, which is full batteries right there. Uh, so even... I don't know, what is it, two, three weeks after the fall equinox, we're still making enough power to run at least the side-by-side -side upstairs uh, with just the 400, 200. It's working out wonderfully. All right, well, that's it for that system. Have a good day and a better tomorrow. And hey, if you haven't liked and subscribed, please do that now. See you.